Hi everybody, welcome back to Father and Son Reactions. I'm Larry, that's my son Ethan, and today is a special day ladies and gentlemen. That's right, that's right. Welcome everyone to the channel. If you're new here, welcome. We post Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays at 1 p.m. Eastern Time. And today is a I'm special day. I'm supposed to hold up the one. You never hold it up. I always hold it up. Well, I just did, so. Say, say it again. All right, all right. Welcome back, everyone, to the channel. If you're new, we post Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays at 1 p.m. Eastern Time. You're not supposed to point at me. Just, just Okay, fine. Just we say. post Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays at 1 p.m. Eastern Time. And today is a special day because it's Nightwish Day. That's right. It's Nightwish Day. And they have never, ever, not once let us down. We've... We've done at least a dozen Nightwish reactions so far, and every single one is like better than the last one. Yeah, almost, that's right. Almost, except for one. Yeah. I think that may not have been like as good as the others, in my humble opinion. Still good though. But still amazing. That's the thing. Like you can hear songs from bands. We could have did this, this many reactions with any other band, and you know what? Guaranteed, we would have came across some songs no, that absolutely no. sucked or we didn't like. Absolutely, you could have did this with any band unless you pick like all their hits. <laughs> Guaranteed, like if we yeah. did this with almost any other band, there would be a minimum of one to two songs out of a dozen. I don't think we because, like. because I don't think but, Nightwish have bad songs. But that's the point of what I'm saying. Yeah. Like, Nightwish is just totally different. We have not come across one song that came close to sucking, and we haven't <laughs> come across one song that was even close to a bathroom song. When we saw them in concert, oh boy, there was zero bathroom songs. I had to hold it in the whole show. Yeah, yeah. And for those of you who don't know what that is, uh, that's like what we call a song that during the concert you might not like that much. So you're like, all right, this is my time to go to the bathroom. Come yeah, back the just time. in time for the next right. song. Right, and you see like when the song starts, everyone starts getting up and moving towards the bathroom and buying something to drink and going to get a shirt. There was not that option at the night. Right, concert. so like... They kept your attention the whole time. Right, so for example, Bruce Springsteen, that would be the whole way through. You gotta, you gotta, <laughs> ruin, gotta ruin, you gotta ruin the moment, don't you? Yeah, yeah, no, I, I made the moment, I made, I made the moment better. I'm sure everyone agrees with me. <laughs> You're the only one who doesn't agree with me. No, you. no, there was someone actually who commented the other day, I don't remember who it was, he actually requested a Springsteen live performance oh, from when he was with the Seeker Sessions band. With it was a period of time he had when he broke up with the E Street band. He like kind of put it on hold. Shit! I, oh, did I just lose our? No, mind? it's still going. Oh, okay. Um, and, and and like it was one of Bruce's, in my opinion, worst times of his career. Like I wouldn't even <laughs> go to the show because it wasn't with the E Street band. And here's this this guy. Requesting a song from that time period, I was blown away. All right, blown all right. away. It, it, it's not your time. That, it, you, you know what? Let's do it. Let's, let's, do it. let's I'm do excited. It. Sorry, I'm excited. sorry to ramble, but yeah, I just have a lot to say today. I guess. I'm yeah, just, it's the the sheer excitement of doing Nightwish. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah. And this is from the new album, so you know, I'm excited. Let's go. Turn it up loud. Oh, not that loud. No, I'm just <laughs> yeah.
and when he shall die, take him and cut him out in little stars, and he will make the face of heaven so fine that all the world will be in love with the night and pay no worship to the garish sun. Well, first off, you want I want me to predict what I think you're going to say. Yeah. All right. I think you're going to say that maybe it's it's a lot different than a lot of their other songs. A lot more. I don't know if the word is low key, but it's it's no, it's not low key. Not not the word I'm looking for. Um, it's different. It's different. It's not. It's a good loud. different. It's a good yeah. Different. It's, it's good not different. as Very good powerful, different. but it's still really good in her voice shines. Oh yeah. Especially the the end. Like the last part of the song. The voice shines. The music is cool. I like the background. Like da, 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 da. Yeah. Like, Alright, well you get it. Yeah. You yeah. Get it. Mm-hmm. I agree, yeah. So usually, like I've said a million times, the main thing I notice that I think gives Nightwish their like uniqueness is the contrast between her angelicness of her voice and how soft it is. I love and then, how he puts things and then I love it. The instruments. Right? That's what I think makes Nightwish Nightwish, is how different they are and how they put both of them together. The heaviness of the instruments and her voice doesn't sound like it should fit together, but it does. That's what I've always said is the main thing that makes Nightwish yeah. oh, Nightwish absolutely. is the difference between her voice and then the instruments. It's how they work together. Yeah, oh, for sure. So in for this sure. song... Like if you separated the, the, the music, the instruments, from the voice... Like you just never, you'd never put them together. Oh yeah, you would have never guessed. You wouldn't think to ever put them together. Uh huh. If you would have said to someone, if you gave somebody just the music and said, "What kind of vocals do you think goes on top of this?" They would think <laughs> yeah, would you would think be, screaming. Right? You would think extremely loud. You'd think a, yeah. like a, a someone just coming at you, you know. And then if you heard just her voice and you said what kind of music, you'd say, oh, you know, maybe just a soft organ in the background, some violin, you know, but then you just like put both together and it's completely different than what you think. And that's For what sure. makes Nightwish Nightwish is that. And that component shined in this song, especially in the, in, in the beginning when they had the heaviness and her voice. And what I love is usually I'll notice in most Nightwish songs is that when she's singing, she sings Still pretty heavy. Like, she, you can tell that she's still singing metal, right? Yeah. But here in the end, it was just pure opera. Yeah. Uh, it was not metal right at all. Her soul. I mean, this, her, her vocals came, it skipped her body. The <laughs> vocals went just from the soul right into the microphone. Yeah. It skipped through everything. Yeah. Like, it just did a complete detour and just, that woman's got a soul yeah. boy that can just wow. Yeah, and I love how in most songs you can see, you can tell that when she's singing, she's still singing a metal song, right? Like sometimes she'll sing aggressively, but here she wasn't. 
That's what I thought was so yes. cool. That it was the opera that we fell in love with when we first heard Nightwish. Oh, it when sure we did was. Ghost Love Score, that oh, was like I'll never forget 90% that day. opera. And that's what it was like here. This reminded me a little bit of Ghost Love Score. Just the how the way it was structured out had heaviness, but also it had that opera feeling to it, which in most Nightwish songs, usually it's just the heaviness. Yeah, well, I didn't feel it, the song was being as heavy as a lot of other songs. Yeah, it was mainly the Musically. opera. It was, yeah. it was mainly the opera, which I really, really like. I, lo- I loved it. I mean, it, it, her voice, like an angel. It is. Just like an angel. It's great. I'm so happy we found this band. Yeah. Yeah. And again, you know what? We got to thank everybody who um, suggested Nightwish in the very beginning. I mean, because uh, I just couldn't imagine not knowing who Nightwish is. Exactly. I I can't imagine it. Like, I feel that, like, they made such an impact on me musically. And I tell people. I, I actually tell people, hey, you ever hear a Nightwish? Yeah. You know? Yeah. Yeah, I know. I've, I've heard you say it when we're talking yeah. to people. You'll bring yeah. them up. I'm like, you ever hear a Nightwish? Like, I don't understand how they just never made it big here in the U.S. I mean, it's just, I get it. It's not the kind of music that you'd ever hear on the radio here. No, I definitely mean, I, I know. I mean, none of the stations I ever listened to would play Maybe that. Maybe a long time ago. No, none of the stations I listen to here, you know, well, I don't listen to me radio. No, that no, much, I'm saying like when not, I do, not these days, but a long right. time ago in the U.S., rock and metal was very big. Yeah, I, yeah, but I, maybe I, I don't know. Just yeah, they're, they're new. They're not new. Not with this. They're new. But this wouldn't have mixed in with the rock and the metal. No, it would have. I think it would have. It's really? just that they're new. They're a new band. Yeah, and metal kind of just isn't but as just big so as it's big in Europe, and and they should have. You know, I feel that, like, they should be big here. It's a shame that they, you know, don't get the airplay here and they don't get a proper introduction. I wish they did. I don't know why. They would Uh, be loved. Yeah, maybe maybe it's their management. I I don't know. Maybe they're more focused on Europe. Maybe Nightwish themselves are more focused on putting themselves out there in Europe than than here. Maybe they feel like the market... Maybe they think the market is bigger there because... That's where they're from. They're from their... Nah, nah. If they, they're, if, if they would be big here, this would be the big, the bigger market. I don't know. Yeah, yeah all Europe the big is... cities here now. And it's easier for, to tour here if you're big. I know, but usually... You know, it... There's so many, so many major cities that if they were That's like true. big time, like they could do so many major arenas, you could do 40, 50 arenas the size of the Wells Fargo Center. I know, I know. In one... Swoop around the U.S. That's it's right. Easy, you bust, zigzag here, there. You know, over in Europe, man, it's harder. No, but the thing is, all you got to go through all these different countries yeah. and, and find the arena. Here, all the big arenas, everything's in place. If they made it big here, believe me, they would do the majority of their touring here. They absolutely would. You're, you got to remember that they're from Europe. That it doesn't matter. It does so matter. So are the Rolling Stones. Where do they tour the most? Here, because here's where the money is. Yeah, but the UK. The who, but look at the, the UK who. is. Hold on. Look at the Who. They do most of their touring here because that's where the money is. But they tour in the UK. They. I didn't say they didn't. But they tour here because here's but where the money is. But they're not a newer band. Like Nightwish, you can't compare them. But if you're so, big, you're the big. Who went, the the Who went for the US and the UK because back then rock music was popular. Nowadays it isn't. So Nightwish can't do what those bands did. They can't do that. Okay, alright, alright. Let's get let's get back to Nightwish. Right? I wish they could because Nightwish are just yeah. they would be like, like if they, they would be here, loved. They would they be should, loved. If, if they toured here and they did like DC, Philly, New York I mean, you and me, man, we just drive down to D.C., see them there, drive here, go to New York. I mean, go to Philadelphia. Yeah, yeah, I mean, you know, we'd be like super fans. Yeah. Going yeah. city to city, Pittsburgh. I mean, yeah. that'd be cool. Yeah, yeah. But, uh, you know, that's not the reality. So here we are sitting in our little studio we made in the garage, and we're just hanging out talking about Nightwing. That's right. <laughs> that's right. It's a shame that they uh, aren't as big as they, they should be here. Yeah, anyway. yeah. But you know what? We love them, and, uh, you know, good thing they're not, in a sense, because we were able to get tickets to sale. <laughs> if they were so huge, it, tickets would have been harder to get. That's true, that's true. But they so I'm happy, I'm grateful I got to see them. I can't wait till they come back to the States again. And um, sorry if we just went rambling on and on and on, but, you know, 
Yeah, yeah. We, uh, so, no, we, I like, think we this, like to talk. Yeah, I think the song was a success. Thought it was good. Thought it was a very different than their other songs, in my opinion. Uh, but still very good. I'd say out of the dozen or so songs we did, I mean, it's it's right there. Yeah, it's, it's right, right up there the with, the, with, the, yeah, with the other great songs we've done. Yeah. I mean, it's no Ghost Love Score, and it's not... You when know, I think of other it. songs that I compare it to, I think of Ghost Love Score. Yeah. And that's like the highest for me. That that was that's wow. That song. I love cool. Harvest. That's one of my favorites. But yeah, the, the the phenomenal band. I can't wait to do more. You guys gotta let us know in the comments um, what comes by them next that we should do. Please oh, yeah. and also that's drop awesome. a link because that would be helpful. There's like twenty different videos for each oh, song. For each song. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. if you could drop the link of the specific live performance that we need to check out, please, please, please drop the link in the comments. Um, and yeah, thank you all so much for joining us today, and we will and, see you all in the next one. Oh, sorry, 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 I'm interrupting. We don't script anything, so you know it's like we just go, you know, we kind of just go for it. We kind of just go for it, but um, we did forget to say, you know, for your first time. No, we did, we did. Oh, you did? Oh, all right. Yeah, you just forgot. All right, cool. Yeah, yeah, I said the Tuesday. And so yeah, Thursday. for not scripting, exactly. making me look like an idiot. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. All right. Well, I know one thing I didn't say. Oh, what is? Hit us up on the Insta.